Hello everyone, in today's video I am going to be going shopping at Scrooge McDuck's store since it is brand new and massive with the new update. We are going to check out hopefully some new items. Now this is the first new item here. I'm not buying this from Monsters Inc. It's the hazmat suit pants. This is really the only item I think that I have left to buy. It's the only one that's like shown up anyway, but I'm gonna wait to see if I get anything for my dream snaps this week for um, clothing and just see if it shows up in there. I'm also keeping an eye in chests that I find around my valley. So hopefully that will all sort of work out and I will not have to spend 50,000 because it's crazy how expensive a pair of pants. Like, I mean, if this is the future of, you know, clothing costs uh, for the valley just for a pair of pants, like, we are in some serious trouble. Like, we're going to need a lot more gold. That's for sure. Um, okay, so the first furniture piece here, we have a lamp from the Lion King, the giraffe lamp for 5,440. Next up from the Little Mermaid for 4,800, the scallop stool. Now this actually goes with the vanity. So if you guys have been lucky enough to find the Little Mermaid vanity, this is definitely the stool you need to have with it. If you don't have it, there are a couple of other options as well until it shows up in your store, but trust me, it looks really good. This is a new item here uh, for 1,200 from Monsters Inc., the MI water cooler. Um, I'm hoping that like this update has been crazy for stuff like for items and stuff like that furniture and all that so I am kind of thinking that maybe in future when they do their next updates and stuff we're gonna see a lot more uh kind of stuff like this not Monsters Inc specifically but just we're gonna get a lot more items with updates so I'm hoping that's gonna be the case um but you know again that's just gonna be something that uh that we'll only be able to tell in time so I'm going to go ahead and buy this for 1200 Holy, there there are a lot of Monsters Inc. items this update. Uh, the black triple drawer counter with black marble top. I'm not going to buy that because I have it. 528 Most counters are 528 For 10000 the majestic golden vase. Yeah, it's ridiculous i have a few from beauty and the beast so i will i will pass on that one because it is it is very pricey for 1800 the wicker bar stool from moana then we've got for 900 the rafiki's bowl um from lion king i'm gonna say i haven't seen that one in a little bit it's not like a rare item i would say or anything but it's just been a while since I've seen it show up there. For 360, the energy drink can. Why does this image look so big? I really have no idea. Anyways, I love it because it has a lightning bolt on it. You know, just a little Harry Potter vibes right there. Yeah, it's cute. Next, upstairs. Oh, well, how exciting. 689, we have the lavish navy blue double bed. So yesterday, I'm going to give you guys a little backstory here if you weren't at my stream. Um, I did end up getting a pretty good store. But there were uh, like four items on this pedestal and they were faced like the wrong way. And it was the same with the other sides. Oh, whoa. Okay. Wow. That item there has my curiosity. Okay. Anyways. And the other side also had that. And I was like, what the heck? I couldn't actually see. I actually had to go like over here and turn the camera just a little bit so I could actually see the front of the item. Um, so I'm not sure what's up with that, but... I think it's just like it's like flipped the wrong way or something but today it's just one bed so sorry it's so boring okay this is what has me intrigued here the skellington's bookshelf large so is there a small version and why is this giving me like harry potter olivander shop like vibes like i feel like we're in the wand shop right now does anybody else see that too? Or is this just me? Let me know in the comment section below. <laughs> this is so crazy. I love it though. It's cool. So I'm going to go and buy this. 8000 They Honestly, they could have charged like 20 for that. Like 100%. But next here. Okay, I've got this. A long dining table from Frozen. Then we have got for 4K, the Sunset Parasol and Green Towel from Lilo and Stitch. So again, like you see a lot of these kind of show up, but remember they're different colors. So I think I've got all the colors for this, the parasols, but um, yeah, just keep an eye if you guys are still kind of working on collecting stuff. For 1,020, the Industrial Ceiling Lights. That image looks really large too for some reason. For 2,720, the Candle Laden Branch. I love these, these are so awesome like they really really are it it obviously depends on the room you're kind of designing or whatever but they are really really neat all right i think we have some new floorings over here 
I think they can only be new. So I'm always worried, though, when you see something like this and you're like, oh, three floors, like patterns left. Does this mean like I don't need any more wallpaper? Like what if that was true? I'm hoping it's not and it was just a coincidence. But um, yeah, this is the first time that this has happened to me since the update. So ooh, I don't know. Anyways, 300, the pale brick and wood barn flooring. I love, love, love that they have three slots now for this kind of stuff. I just, I don't know how we survive before. Like I used to sometimes like after refreshing my store, I would just settle on whatever flooring. And like now I'm going, what was the point? That was a whole store refresh day. But yeah, anyways, it's just a thing. The dark marble flooring. I'm going to wait till it turns back around. This actually kind of looks metallic a little bit, like when it catches certain light. So I'd be really interested to sort of see how that pans out. So I guess depending on what your ceiling lamp is. Um, but yeah, this could be really interesting flooring right there all right for 300 we have the bright rustic tile flooring so actually i think i got this i think i want to say this yesterday during my stream and it's like it was like the yellowy version of this but i kind of like this bright rustic like a lot better but yeah that's cool right i'm not sure what kind of room i'm gonna use it with but i am still designing rooms so all the time and uh yeah we'll just kind of see i didn't do any though this week with the update and everything i was like yeah it's just you know the update stuff's gotta come first and obviously this store just has me like massively excited so i've been a little bit like slacking on the the decorating this week but there's gonna be lots of time for that when i finish up all the quests uh, for 480 here, the black single door top cover left handle. No, thank you. I, if I own it, I don't need it. For 2880, the wall mounted TV. So this TV, if you guys are like, why is it white? What kind of TV? Why do I want that on my wall? Don't worry, it actually shows your memories on it. So this can be really useful. I find the quality isn't as great as like you know those gold framed sort of pictures that you put the memories in. Um, that I find the quality is really good. This I found it's like kind of low quality TV graphic kind of idea. Like I think it's intentional, but uh, yeah, just so you guys know, that's that's what it's for, and uh, it is really cool, sort of in like modern rooms and stuff like that. Like if you were doing your sci-fi dream snaps like a few weeks ago, like and you wanted a TV, this was like your best bet for the wall, like for a wall TV. So um, yeah, I, I just I think that that can be really useful depending on what kind of look you're going for. For 5440 from the Lion King collection, the floral mirror. This mirror is really pretty. I do really like it. I own several of these. Um, but yeah, these these are really neat. And they're not just, I feel like, Lion King specific. Like, I feel like you could totally, if you wanted to, for like Tangled or whatever, you could do that. For any cottage core decorating, you could use it. Like, there's literally so, so much. So I think that this particular mirror that, like, uh, I just think it has so many uses. So I wouldn't pass up on that if that shows up to your shop, for sure. Still think that there there should be something they sell here, but maybe in time because it's, it's empty. The other side has something, and I feel like this was sort of designed for that, but I don't know. I don't know. Maybe in future they'll do something cool like that, but for now, it is what it is. Okay, so I think I need to find Scrooge again because I would like to buy more of that freaking bookshelf because that was so cool. Uh, let's see. We had Nightmare Before Christmas and Monsters, Inc. was the other one that I got there. Um, hold on a second. Did they just add the Brave Universe and Pirates of the Caribbean? They totally did. What else did they freaking add? Beauty and the Beast 2017. Okay. Why are they splitting Beauty and the Beast up? That's what I would like to know. Like, that's crazy. 1991, sure. But, like, uh, why are you splitting Beauty and the Beast up? I don't know. That's got to mean something. But I don't have a freaking clue. Mm -hmm. I am perplexed. I'm still perplexed, though, why Maleficent has her own thing. And yet Sleeping Beauty doesn't, like, kind of fit in with it. You know? Like... 
it has its own category, but, you know, why does Maleficent get her own, too? I don't know. But, anyway, I am very curious about what they're actually doing. Oh, I was supposed to also put the filter for um, Nightmare Before Christmas, and I forgot to click it. Okay, so now I'll go through and buy whatever I feel I need from these two collections here. These ended up being really cool. I, I did really like the scary surprise boxes, but the thing is you have to interact with them for them to do stuff. I kind of just wish they would just automatically do stuff on their own, like every 30 seconds or something like that. Did you guys see how much that would have cost me if I bought a thousand of them? And you can't sell. So if you make a mistake now, you're freaking doomed. Like, that's just ridiculous, honestly. Like, nobody wants that. Nobody. Uh, there are a couple of things I didn't buy more than one. I guess I will buy one more of that. Uh, this picture, apparently, um, I was noticing, like, online that some people, like, are going crazy over the Winds of Change picture. Um, but, yeah, I was like, oh, okay, yeah, it's cool. But I didn't, I didn't, it wasn't going crazy about it, but... Anyway, this is from, uh, was it Mike, I think? Mike's uh, Level Up Rewards. So I did manage to get a hold of the posters. I think those will be really cool. I love these little Cyclops guys. They are so much freaking fun. Not in love with this phone. Like, not in love with it. Um, this would have been great, just so you guys know, for the gym dream snaps. Like, I feel like a lot of people would have used that. But... And I have to remember now not to just out of instinct when I'm like, oh, I'll just take the rest of them being at a thousand, like with now that it's a thousand. Because, I mean, honestly, I couldn't even afford it, to be honest, because apparently it's 7.8 million if you wanted 978 of them. Like, what the frig? But yeah, I basically have to try and train myself not to go backwards now. It's so wild. Oh, let's get a couple of those. So, uh, oh, this one here. I should buy a few of these plaques just because they're so expensive, though, for a little plaque. Like, what the heck? I seriously need to farm like I am under 2 million now and I am not happy about it and it's not like oh it's just a hundred thousand like it's over a hundred thousand now that I need so I am a little bit rattled on it but um yeah it is what it is so now all that's left basically is for me to just come up with something fabulous to wear that is relatively new for you guys I think what I'll do though just to be because I just designed, like, an outfit, actually, the other day. And I think since we just had the update or whatever, I think it would be really cool just to get a picture in my newly designed room. I haven't even put up the speed build for this yet. So I did this um, on stream. My uh, remodeling for my uh, Beauty and the Beast room. So officially, all three of these rooms. So Rapunzel from Tangled, Cinderella, obviously, from Cinderella, and then Belle from Beauty and the Beast. They all got a remodel. They were The bedrooms were over a year old. There were new items and stuff like that. So um, I, I go into these ones probably the most out of any of the rooms, especially the Tangled one. Uh, but yeah, I just, I always find myself on my third floor. It's just, it's ridiculous. So <laughs> I love it though. Let me know what you think of my brand new Beauty and the Beast room. I think it's pretty awesome. I'm actually waiting for Beauty and the Beast memory for up top there. I don't have one yet, believe it or not. I was like, what the heck? Um, but this is from the new pack for Beauty and the Beast for Belle specifically. I thought we were getting quest with it, but we didn't, but we did get some like really amazing items. Oh, look at that. I did it daily. So yeah, anyways, I love these PJs. They are so, so cute. And uh, yeah, this is my new room with all the new stuff. So I had initially done it like early 2023 so there's been like obviously a beauty and the beast update i've gotten a lot of new items and now with this update there's like a lot of stuff so i feel like everything is is kind of it's kind of just awesome now like beauty and the beast has got so many great things so yeah hopefully everybody enjoyed my video today don't you just love the cucumber eyes i think it's it's so perfect i think they're hilarious but yeah <laughs> Hopefully everybody enjoyed my video today. Don't forget to leave it a big Mickey thumbs up if you did. And I will see everybody very soon either on stream or you will see me do another uh, Scrooge shopping video. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye.